My favorite sale to date. I paid around 25 cents on what I thought was a keychain. Hey, Bolo Buddies, thanks for watching. All right, you guys, in this video, we are going to do something a little bit different. We're going to talk about bolos, but bolos with a cool story. So let's get started here. This is what I posted in the Bolo Buddies Facebook group. If you guys want to come on over and share a bolo, I have up share your best February bolo, share your best jewelry bolo, and share your best plush bolo. So this is a great way to share a sold link and people can click on that link and maybe even go and check out your store. And also if you have a YouTube channel or you want to shout out your eBay store or whatever platform you're selling on, feel free to shout that out in the comments and I will read it as I do this video. All right. Are you ready for this one? Saw Courtney's video about this plush and we're going to pull this one up and I could not actually pull it up anymore because it was over the 90 days but I found it on Terapeak. So she said, saw Courtney's video about this plush. Next day, found one for sale on Facebook Marketplace for $20. Asked them if they would take 15. They said, yes, I couldn't get there fast enough. I was so nervous that they would sell it to someone else. Listed first for auction, later added a buy it now price. Sold 15 minutes after the buy it now to a international buyer for $162.50. My store is Boho Country Grandma. Thanks, Courtney. This is the third Bolo item I've found and sold from watching your videos. Oh, thank you so much. So it is a Build-A-Bear, is it Doobie Plush? 18 inch talks with Sock House Elf Harry Potter, two, uh, 2022. And you can see this one right here only sold for $30. So here's what I'm guessing. I'm guessing either this is a different Build-A-Bear or this person did not do their research because she sold it for $162.50. Let's see if we can find a date. November 6th of 2023, $162.50. September 11th of 2023 for $30. Definitely, definitely, definitely always do your research, especially on Build-A-Bear. I have a couple Build-A-Bear videos that talk about big money Build-A-Bear. So if you type in Bola Buddies, Build-A-Bear, it will pull up those listings. This in, this in, <laughs> when I forget to separate my words, it becomes this in. This one Hudson Valley Community College Diploma Associate in Arts Ephemera, Troy, New York. And this is what it looks like. Went to my first estate sale in November and they had a lot of ephemera from my local high school and the nearby community college. So I picked it all up, including this diploma, which sold in less than 24 hours. So it's somebody's diploma. Like who, who buys that? It's so random. And it really makes you think, what am I walking past? Now, was it a big money bolo? No, but definitely unexpected. This sold for $12.99. And I believe the buyer paid shipping on that one. So definitely a cool story. This one right here. Are you ready? Oh my goodness. This is a Chrome Hearts Rolling Stone 0.18 carat diamond sterling silver 2002 on a 20 inch chain. It's the Rolling Stones, guys. But wait until you hear the story. Are you ready? <laughs> I am posting for Mishka923 because she does not have Facebook. She says, I was at a garage sale where you had to dig. I pulled a bunch of things out of purses and I thought I was buying a Rolling Stone keychain. When I looked up the Chrome Hearts name, I realized... I had a solid sterling pendant, and with my gem tester, it was also a diamond. I did my research and found the exact carat weight, etc. I listed it high, and after six months or so, I took an offer of $800. eBay sent it to GIA to be authenticated. Authentic I can't say that word. And it passed to get authenticity guarantee. How about that? 
somebody uh, like spaced it out for me and I could say it when I saw it spaced out when I read it. But man, I cannot figure that word out. eBay. Uh, let's see. My favorite sale to date. I paid around 25 cents on what I thought was a keychain. Thank you so much for letting me participate. I truly appreciate you and love your videos, Mishka. And she is also on Whatnot, you guys. So definitely give her a follow over there as well. And I am Bolo Buddies on Whatnot. If you use my referral link down below, you can get $15 to shop on Whatnot. It is a great place to source. But she paid $0.25 cents for this and sold it for $800. She thought it was a keychain. Do you love it? I love it. All right, here's the next one. This one is a Lily Pulitzer mini elephant pink sand paradise. Look how pretty it is. Found this cute Lily Pulitzer elephant at my local Goodwill for eight and sold it for 60 before fees. So um, I don't know if it, yep, it is signed. Let's look at the picture here. If I can get it to open up, it's not going to open. It's right here, right here on the tush. And it actually says Lily Pulitzer, it looks like. So I did not know that Lily Pulitzer made plush. So that is a really cool story. Thank you for sharing. And that was sold on Poshmark. Dog Tivity, Dog Christmas Manger Nativity Guardian Angel figurine. It is a dog nativity, guys. Have you ever seen such a thing? She said, I went to a community club sale and her hubby found this. It ended up having a dog nativity, dog nativity set. She said, I got all nine pieces for $7.50. I sold the first one for $15 plus shipping. So it looks like she is parting it out. But the interesting thing here is, is that they have dog nativities. Would you have picked it up or walked past it? Let me know in the comments. This one comes from Childhood Finds, and she has a YouTube channel that is fantastic. Definitely follow her and subscribe. This is an Antique Roger Smith Meridian CT Quadruple Plate Silver Cat Kitty Figurine. And I just want to show you this. It's about that big. She said, I picked this up at a yard sale for $2 late in the day. It was laying on a concrete on the concrete scattered with Barbie toys. I recognized the company name and knew it was an antique and rescued it from its certain demise into a trash bin. <laughs> this piece was actually originally a napkin ring, but got broken at some point. Wow, great information. Even being broken, this little guy still sold for $60. We, all, we are all more than just resellers. We are rescuers of history. And that is definitely a cool story. Chick-fil-A. I visited my sister in Georgia and we went thrift shopping. I bought so much I had to check a bag at the airport just for the thrifted items. This one comes from Piece of Scrap. She is also over on YouTube. Give her a follow. She's got some cool bolos. She said, I purchased four of these Chick-fil-A shirts for $3 each. The first one sold for $36, shipped on eBay, and it was shipped back to Georgia. Since then, I've sold another one for $30 and have two left. It's a Chick-fil-A shirt. Would you have walked past it or picked it up? And what did she say? Sold it for $36. All right, you guys. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for watching. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Do you like the share a cool story bolo post? Not a lot of you posted on this one, but those of you that did, super fun bolos. Check out the links down below. Those are things that I use for my business. And I know some of you have asked about my ring light uh, that I use for whatnot because it has an adjustable arm and it faces down and it also lifts up. It's great for taking photos and also for recording. If you're on YouTube or whatnot, definitely check out that ring light. I do have a referral affiliate link and you will get 10% off your uh, purchase with referral code Bolo Buddy. So type that in when you check out and that link's down below. So that is a new link that I have for you guys. And I worked hard to get that. So um, I hope you guys enjoy that. There's also this new thing that they have and Cat Feel and Thrifty just bought it. So I'm waiting to hear from her, but it's a little um, 
light that you stick on the top of your phone. And so I think it would be great if you were taking pictures. I don't know. I haven't tried it. But a lot of people, um, they show people using it as on their phone if they're doing maybe a TikTok or an Instagram post or a short. And it just gives that extra light. So I don't know. Check it out, too. That's a new uh, item that they have over there. All right, you guys. And that is on Canvas. So check that out and check out that referral link down below to get your discount. All right. Thanks so much for being here. Thank you for watching. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Head over to the Facebook group and share your bolo and definitely put your information so that I can give you a shout out. Thanks for watching.